Hi friends, I'm so happy to tell you everything about EFP campaign. But before that, I think you should know a little bit about myself so you can decide if I am worthy of your support. So I was born and raised in India. I did my accounting from India and came to Canada in 2000, right, Calgary. And I'm so happy that Calgary is my home. I have lived my life uh, in financial industry. That's the only thing I know. I've had my own consulting practice with IG Wealth Management for about 20 years. And um, if we talk about my current life, uh, I don't have a spouse. I don't have children. I am by myself. I am also not perfect. I have made blunders in my life. Um, I may make more blunders. I um, I can't promise that I would ever be perfect. But because I'm by myself, it gives me a chance to find the purpose of my life. One of the things you know that have been bugging me for a very very long time that. Um, India gave me everything, my childhood, education, India fed me and uh, I did not do anything for India or people of India. So I am planning to return to India in 2028. But now I don't want to take the guilt back to India that I did not do anything for Canada. Seriously, Canada gave me everything. Uh, it gave me success, uh, happiness, wealth, good friends, good life, good moments, good experiences, good practice, good learning. I mean, whatever goodness I have in my life, I believe it came from Canada and people of Canada. So I really, really wanted to do something for Canada. And uh, what could I do that can help Canada? Because I'm just me, I'm not um, a huge corporation like uh, Microsoft or Coca-Cola. Um, and I don't have much intelligence. The only thing I know is uh, financial planning. So when I reflected on financial planning experience, it was quite clear to me that I wanted to support financial planning. And this is why EFP, Everest for Financial Planning. I'm gonna talk more about EFP later, but let me tell you what I think of financial planning. In my 20 years of wealth management practice, my clients have taught me everything. I learned so much from my clients. I have seen what happens when clients do the right thing based on their financial planning and i've also seen uh, what may happen if clients don't make the right call based on prudent financial planning so i wanted to bring some support to financial planning uh, and the financial planning industry So when I think of supporting financial planning of financial planning industry, the next question was, what can I do? My instant observation was uh, financial planning doesn't get enough attention from people and families. Uh, financial planning is never a priority in their lives until they go through some financial crisis. And also I was fortunate enough to have a conversation with FP Canada, uh, who owns the CFP title, Certified Financial Planner title. Um, I learned some shocking facts. For example, financial planning industry is male dominated. Uh, this industry could definitely benefit from diversity and many other factors. So this is uh, all about financial planning. When I, or financial planning industry, when I look at my own personal life, 
I wanted to explore my limits. I wanted to see who I am or what I'm capable of. And um, I could have chosen uh, anything out of many possibilities. I chose hanging. Um, I don't know why when I was in mid 40s or late 40s I started hiking you could call it midlife crisis peer pressure or whatever else anyway so I started hiking and I got hooked to hiking so much so that um, I want to do Everest now this would be a perfect combination of what I want to do for Canada versus what I want to achieve in my life to combine together and this combination is what I used to create EFP campaign. EFP is Everest for financial planning. I am going to climb Everest to increase the awareness um, about financial planning in every Canadian's mind. I want every Canadian to know the importance of financial planning and support it fully. EFP campaign has two distinct objectives. The most important and the first objective is I want to increase Canadian's awareness towards financial planning. I want to tell every Canadian through EFP campaign that financial planning is good and they should do financial planning. Second objective is I want to raise $750,000 for a scholarship fund for FP Canada. The scholarship fund will release six scholarships every year of $5,000 each and it will benefit students who are pursuing CFP designation. Two of the scholarships I intend to be awarded to females. Two should go to immigrants and two for general category. And this structure that I have in mind is all based on my learning from FP Canada and uh, some of the good adjustments that the financial industry could benefit from, for example, diversity and engaging more female advisors in the future, etc. Here is the most important part. I am seeking your help. You can help in four ways. First, you can simply give me your blessings and wishes that I stay safe and I become successful in my mission of uh, setting up the scholarship fund and uh, increasing the awareness. So your blessings and wishes alone are very, very valuable to me. If you want to go to next level, then I'll request you to come forward and share your thoughts about financial planning do a testimonial uh, encourage your friends and family to do their testimonials about the importance of financial planning so that would be wonderful if more people come and share their thoughts and encourage each other to do financial planning uh, third level is uh, as you know that i am uh, raising money for the scholarship fund as well um, so if you like to donate i will be very very grateful and final level is if you want to be the ambassador of financial planning, like you have a network of people or you're one of the influencers or you believe this is such a good cause that you want everybody in your community to know, then you could become an ambassador and uh, raise funds um, and do events. But for that, we will also be happy to help you out. Um, also, I want to mention one more thing that all the donations you're going to make will be 100% tax deductible. It's a registered charity and um, all your money will go directly to the cause. No money comes to me or no money comes and fund my Everest expedition. So I again want to thank you from the bottom of my heart for even listening to me and um, I hope you will find one of the ways, one of the four ways to support this campaign. Thank you. 
I wish you a very happy, healthy, and wealthy life. Thank you.